All right, welcome back to the Ireland Contracting Nightly Port Sports Call. Rich Walsh alongside Paul Zeiss. We're going to go right out the phone lines. We're going out to Clint in Altoona. How you doing, Clint? Good. How you guys doing? Thanks for taking my call. Thanks for calling. Hey, um, I want to ask you a question. I know you said earlier about uh, New England, if they win the Super Bowl, it'll probably be maybe the best time the NFL has ever seen, you know, winning three out of four two different times. But in my opinion, you might, uh, you know, be indifferent to it. But I don't see any of the Patriot teams that, have won the Super Bowl, including this year, if they do win. How, how do you think that they would, I mean, I can't really put them uh, over or even equal to any of the best teams, uh, the Indiana Dynasty teams, you know, the Steelers, the San the 49ers, the Dallas, and for that matter, the 86 Bears. I know the rules are especially with the uh, the offense, you know, getting most of the, the pub and everything and the defense not being able to do what they, you know, could do back then. Um, how do you think, you know, New England would fare against, you know, say like an 86 Bears defense or something like that? All right, thanks for your call, Clint. There's no question that this team is a dynasty, whether they lose or win. Um, but I don't know if any of these teams were great teams. I think they were just set up well, Again, structured I well, think, I think the great big, coaching. Yeah, I think the big thing is the organization uh, yeah. is a dynasty. Yes. This team is a dynasty. Um, I don't know that any of these teams were te – and, and here's a big, uh, a big tell for me. Moss, Gronkowski, Brady. Who are the other Hall of Famers? Not many. I mean, Maybe, they, they've had, what, Edelman. I'm not Hall of Famers, but I'm, I'm just saying. I'm talking about Hall of Famers. That Steelers dynasty had, what, 13 of them? Yeah, I it's mean, that Cowboys, Brady's the big one here. That, he, he's the know, one that makes this whole thing go. That Cowboys, you know. Dynasty. Never had a running back that was any to good. Me, well, Corey Dillon. But my point is, if you look at this whole thing, they are – a dynasty in that, as an organization, they have dominated the NFL for 16 years. I mean, for think about it. 16, you know, Brady and Belichick have been together 16 years, okay? There was the one year in between, so, you know, it's been 17 years, but Brady was out the one year. So, say 16 yeah. years, they've been together. They've got 15, they've got 15 division titles. They've got eight AFC titles, which means every other year they win the AFC. It's amazing. And they have, you know, five Super Bowls so far. My point is they've dominated the NFL, but I don't know that any of these teams have, have been dominant, you know, and it's a different argument. Do I think that the Cowboys team from, like, with Irving and, and Emmitt Smith? What, the early guys, 90s team? Yeah, I don't think yeah. any of these Patriots teams would. But then again. 85 Bears? No, I think but, the, Bear, but again, the Bears But then win. again, you've got to take the factor that Belichick and Brady – I, I'm not betting against them. It would be hard to. All right, let's go out to Jim in Turtle Creek. How you doing, Jim? Hey, guys, doing well. How you guys doing? Good. Thanks for calling. Sure thing. Thanks for taking my call. Love the show. Uh, Rick, I want to say your hair looks great. Oh, thanks, man. Uh, That's but, the best compliment. Uh, so I'm, I'm an avid social media user, and I'm following uh, both Lev Bell and Juju. And I want to know what you guys think, if there's any truth to the rumor that they're posting that uh, LeBron James would leave the Cavaliers and come to the uh, Stillers to play some tight end. I think they're just having fun. There's no way that's going to happen. But uh, you know what? I think they go a little too far. Now that we're on the social media thing here, I think that those two guys maybe go a little too far. And that's another reason, you know, make, make however you want of this, but that's another reason New England is superior. You never yeah. see these guys. How about the Penguins? Not one guy on social media, hardly. I mean, these guys, you would never see any controversial anything. Yeah. No, I, I think that Juju Smith-Schuster was fun, and now he's going overboard. Yeah. You know, the thing with the Patriot, the kid with the Patriots shirt, I just thought that was you know, unnecessary. Exactly. All right, we got to take a break. Uh, back with maybe a couple tweets, phone call if we can, and to wrap things up.